Hello everyone, welcome back to Techie Pocket, and welcome to my very first video using the HMN Sound Microlav. Go ahead and leave a comment down below to let me know if this sounds okay, because I was having a few issues with it trying to record it using my smartphone, because for some reason my smartphone isn't giving it good quality. But anyways, let's move on to my impressions of the ATH M20Xs. As for the pros, it's cheap at under $30, it's lightweight, and it's very, very comfy on your head. The treble bass and mediums are great for the price, and it's a very good option for budget audio editing. As for the cons, it's very uncomfy for heavy use if you want to wear it for a long time. The ear pads are not big enough to go over your ears, and I think that's the main problem for why you can't wear it for a while, because it bends your ears because it's not big enough and that causes strain in your ears after a while of wearing it. A another bad thing is that it doesn't have good build quality. For example, this cable right here you can see is just exposed right there, and that's not the best way to do it. I did have to change the ear pads, which is why they're blue, because I needed some bigger ones, and that's about it. So as for my conclusion, this is a very good headset for budget audio editing under $30. So if you're looking for a cheap and affordable headset for editing videos or audio, go ahead and grab this one because it'll work perfectly for you. Also, sorry for the PC noise in the background. Anyways, I hope this was helpful, if it was at all, because I don't really know how to review headsets that great. Leave a comment down below to let me know what you think about this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.